Welcome to part two of our alarm introduction series. In this segment, we'll be focusing on how to effectively manage security alarms and respond to abnormal upload alarms, ensuring your system stays secure and alert. One of the most important functions of Firewalla is to detect suspicious activities, such as malware downloads, phishing, open ports, abnormal uploads, and other concerning events. Firewalla utilizes deep insight network flows and its unique cloud-based behavior analytics engine actively monitors and detects suspicious activities. By default, Firewalla has the Active Protect feature turned on. It automatically blocks access when an activity is determined to be dangerous. When such an alarm is raised, it also creates a new blocking rule under the Active Protect rule list. To undo the blocking, just delete the rule from here. This type of alarm only has an archive option because the system has taken action for you. However, it's still highly recommended that you view the alarm detail page to educate yourself on what's been blocked. When you open the alarm detail page, it shows you which device on your network triggered this alarm, where this device is communicating to, and the destination site info. This includes site registration, the location of the server, and sometimes the previous six hours data transfer between the device and the remote destination. Abnormal upload is another type of alarm that tells you the data transfer appears to be different from your typical network behavior. Firewalla analysis device behavior for a period of time. So even if the device has left the network after uploading, you may still receive an abnormal upload alarm triggered by data transfer several hours ago. To investigate what really happened, check the timestamp first and recall if it was triggered by known events, such as, were you the one who triggered the upload? Were you viewing the camera remotely? Is uploading data part of the device's normal behavior? You can also tap on the alarm to enter the detail page. Look at the device and destination info and amount of data transferred. If a Google device is transferring data to Google, then likely the transfer is legit. If the upload alarm is to a country of questionable nature, you should investigate further. In this example, we have an Amazon Ring device that has uploaded some data to a remote IP address. The alarm detail shows us that the IP address is owned by Amazon. Since it is normal behavior for this device to upload data to its manufacturer's site, we can decide to mute this alarm and prevent similar alarms being raised in the future. Sometimes the situation may not be as straightforward as this one. You may tap the IP or domain from here to trigger a security info lookup and cross-check the results on various well-known sites. When turning our attention back to the alarm list, we notice that the ring has been uploading data to a various list of IP addresses owned by Amazon. The destination IP addresses all fall into an IP range of 34.233.0.0. So instead of muting them one by one, we can mute by IP range. To do this, delete the alarm setting created above and create a new setting to mute the IP range. If there are multiple IP ranges that you wish to mute, you can create a target list that contains all the IP ranges on Firewalla Web Interface or Firewalla MSP and mute the target list with a few taps. To summarize, Firewalla analyzes your network traffic and raises alarms to notify you about different things, but it doesn't require you to handle every alarm. So please take action carefully where you find necessary. Whether archived or not, all alarms will be auto-deleted in 30 days after being generated. If you have any further questions, please write to us, help at firewalla.com. Happy networking.